Hey guys, John V from Phone Rainer here. Right now I have the Samsung Galaxy S5 with me and I'm just gonna show you one of the neat features of the handset which pertains to the rear with that new fingerprint sensor which is right below the camera next to the LED flash. So it's really hard to make it out. Let me see if I could show this here to you. So there is the fingerprint sensor, that tiny thing right there. And you could use it to actually measure your pulse rate. So I'm gonna show you how you get that done here. So uh, it, it actually works in conjunction with the, with the S Health application. So let's get into that. Go to S Health here. Let's... So here, here's the uh, S Health application. There's an option here for heart rate. So you quickly just press that and tells you just to place, hold your hand over the sensor in the back and do not move. So let's do that. Let's put our finger like so and same time hit OK. So it says measuring and uh, can't talk. OK, we screwed up. So it took a little bit, just a couple tries to get it to work. So as it said there, do not stand still and do not talk as you're measuring your pulse rate. But we tried out doing that and it gave us a pulse rate of 92 beats per minute. So it's, it's, it's nice that you have that. Now, it's hard to say how it's going to be actually practical or become useful just because um, you probably want to do it on a consistent basis and under the same conditions. So probably a resting rate uh, as opposed to, you know, one time resting or another time, uh, you know, right after exercising. But you have that functionality and this is how, how it does it. And if we go to the graph here, it'll show you day by day what your pulse rate's like. So like I said, you want to do it under the same conditions each and every time. So that's a quick look at the heart rate feature of the Samsung Galaxy S5. If you want to learn more about it, guys, you can check out our website, phonerena.com. John V. Thanks for watching.